it is time for the main event, and what a main event it was! This the was, eyes of Mark. Uh, yeah, this was really a titanic clash between two former friends, you could say. <laughs> you have on one hand the upgrade, the former hotshot Mike Reed, now the leader. You, you can certainly Burgundy say Virginia. he is the leader. He I, is, uh, the, has the most experience of all the guys. As as he put it, he's traveled everywhere, Hicks. As he put it, he's taken those guys under his wing. Yeah. Yeah. And on the, and on the other hand, who do we have on the other hand, Dean? Oh. It's got to be a big hand. It's a large hand, and it's a very uh, well. It's a dummy's hand. Yeah. Have you heard of the dead man's hand in poker? Well, Tank Tolan has the dummy's hand. That's when you have a, a two and a six. I don't know what that means. But the thing is, now... It's a tank hand! The champion, Tank Tolan! Yes, it's Tank Tolan, the biggest dummy, the biggest star on the show, but also the biggest dummy. He defended his championship. He went out there. I will give credit where the credit is due. He went out there alone against the entire Burgundy Brigade. Who stood tall at the end of this NMR Wrestling heavyweight title match? Check it out. Slim Burgundy. He said, I saw potential. I want to help these guys get even better than they can be. Well, he adds a certain veteran flair. He does. I mean, he's been around the business, what, 14, 15 he years? He also adds a pedigree to that group that it just didn't have before. Well, they certainly didn't have a champion. They could have a double champion here tonight. And the thing is, Tank Tolan, he is a dummy. He might he's be outsmarted. A dummy? He might be outsmarted by the upgrade, Mike Reed. I'll tell you what, I wouldn't want to be opposite Tank Tolan. I will say that. Now see, is this your champion? Your champion is somebody who's going to say, what, what is going on? There are children He's present. having fun. Having fun? Yep. Making He's an obscene fun. gesture? He didn't make an obscene gesture. Sure he did. He was pointing to his, well, never he was mind. He scratching his leg. Look at this. He's arrogant. Trunks can get pretty sweaty, dude. He's arrogant. He knows he's the best right now. There's nothing wrong with being proud of being the champion, dude. This, it disgusts me. A man like that, you look at a man like that, you see, you see all these things. You see all these things. You remember when you were in high school and you got shoved into a locker by the, by, by the quarterback? Do you remember that, Hicks? I couldn't fit in the lockers, Dean. They were like little and thin, and we didn't have we didn't have football in my high school, so I was fine. Anyway, not the bell that has, I was a nerd. I wasn't a nerd. The bell is rung, and these two are ready to lock Look up. Look at this. You know what? Get ready for a clinic. I like, I like two lions circling. You know there can only be one. There they go. The lockup. We're, we're lobbying for power position right now. now where, where's, the where's the count? Where's the count? They are on the ropes. Where? Anthony Rock not doing his job. He was waiting for them to get to the corner. I will say, if clean I want a break, clean break. If I want, Reed. if I want a referee to maintain order, I would pick Anthony Gigante for this match. I will say that. Mike Reed, keep motioning to the ladder. Well, not only that, not only that, a clean break kicks. Why don't you give him credit for that? You want credit every time something he does something right? Arm drag takedown. Well, little less takedown, but definitely an arm drag. These two, the the the, the pace will quicken. I can guarantee you that. Tank Tolan just getting warmed up. Upgrade Mike Reed. We haven't even seen anything really out of him yet, but we're going to see it. We're you know what? See it. You know what, Dean? It might be to Mike Reed's benefit that Tank Tolan wasn't here last month because he didn't get to hear all the nasty things that Mike Reed said about him. He didn't say much about Tank Tolan per se. He said, "Hey, he was handed everything," and that is true. He was handed. How can you say so, that? He was handed the heavyweight championship opportunity. Who said why? Why, why was Tank Tolan the man chosen? If they won that match, why was he chosen to have that heavyweight title? Because he gets everything he because wants. Because he should have beaten Jake Bishop the month before. He gets everything he wants. He should have beaten Jake Bishop the month before. He has everything handed to him. This lock. Oh! Look, look, look. Tank 
Tolan has had everything in his career handed to him. He hasn't worked hard. He's had because he, he has hasn't that worked look. hard. He has that. Look. Are you insane? And I'm tired of seeing it myself. Tank Tolan is the definition of hard work and getting to the top by your own. And Mike Reed isn't. And Mike Reed isn't. Mike Reed is the United States champion, and I'm Wait very excited for Mike Reed. Wait a second. But at the end of the day, Tank Cullen is just, the one who climbed the ladder and won Mike Reed that U.S. Just, title. Just you two remember months ago, that. Just two months ago, Hicks. Actually, I didn't see it. But two months ago, Hicks. I, I, re I remember you were singing the praises of Mike Reed. I am. And I'm not being disrespectful now. You but are at the end of the day, Hicks. Tank Tolan did win Mike Reed his look, United States title. Victory. And look, and front watch face this lock, match. Front face lock by the top star in New Moon Dean. And until he gets knocked off his perch, he is the top star. You can't argue that. I can't argue. But handed. you're not right. Everything was handed to him. He should have beaten Jake Don Bishop Warren, in December. Don Warren, his best friend. Who do you think was behind the apology last month, Hicks? Don Warren. That had nothing to Tank do with Tank Tolan. That. Give me a break. It had nothing to do with Tank, Tank Tolan. Tank Tolan wasn't even here. What's wrong with you? You should have had to kiss Tank Tolan's feet. That's a little disgusting, Hicks. You should have had to. And in the dirty old proving grounds, no less. Now, anyway, back. Uh, Tank Tolan controlling things here with a side headlock. Side headlock takedown right now. Tank Tolan is in control. You can't argue that. They're still in the feeling now process. There you go. Here. Mike Reed, of course, using that veteran knowledge to roll him up. And Tank seeing that has adjusted. Well, you know what? We have two veterans right now, so you're going to see a series of adjustments, a series of jockeying to get the upper hand. I think you've got to give the power edge to Tank Tolan. Can you, or you're not going to argue with that, are you? I'm not going to disagree with that. Tank Tolan is a powerful man. Obviously, he has worked out on his body. He has, he really has. At least in the gym, he has worked hard. There you go. You see the superior ring. Oh, what happened there? Well, Tank refusing to quit. But Slim Burgundy, now Burgundy's gonna oh, get him going. Oh, beautiful maneuver. Oh! He deserved that. And so did. My goodness. Every member of the Burgundy Brigade is getting what they believe. Oh! Oh, but Mike Reed, one step ahead. I, a lot of action happened there. That was smart. Tank Tolan pulled off by Slim Burgundy. I believe he was trying to help Slim Burgundy out. But Slim Burgundy was trying to help him out. Like grabbing his foot and pulling him off the apron? No, he had a shoelace untied. So he's trying to help him out. How does Tank Tolan re repay this gratitude? By striking both members of the Burgundy Brigade who happened to be there to say, Tank, your shoelace. You talk about guys having things handed to them. Mike Reed just had this opportunity handed to him. What opportunity? What are you talking about? He, he had the opportunity to drop kick a distracted Tank Tolan outside the ring. And now Toland is down because he landed on concrete because of interference because when the Burgundy Brigade is out there, it's always a handicap match. I'm not sure what you're talking about. They were just trying to be helpful. But anyway, back into the ring. We have Mike Reed. Mike Reed into the post, into the corner, down he goes. My goodness. My goodness. Tank Toland is in a bad way and I love it. You better promise me you stay here. If I find out you're in the Burgundy Brigade, I'm going to be very disappointed. Oh, that's never going to happen like that. Very disappointed. That's never going to happen. Yeah. You know, the only thing I'm going to do is pick this. Oh, just leave your banner down. It clearly doesn't deserve to be up that high. Anyway, getting back to the action in the ring. Tank Cohen's still trying to get in. Well, he's, he's finally, finally finding his way See, back in. See, you know what a smart champion does? A champion like Jake Bishop. Jake Bishop, when he had enough, he left. What does a champion have to prove? Nothing. Well, you know what? They're already champions. You want to talk about smarts. Mike Reed knew enough to leave the ring and get back in to keep the count alive so that Tank Tolan didn't get counted out. There's some intelligence. So I will give, I will give Mike Reed credit. Is he as good as Tank Tolan, though? I reserve judgment on that. I think we're going to see here tonight. There it is. Oh, come on. He 
Vikings fans cheering for Tank Dolan. He obviously has something in his eye, and uh, he's trying to help him out there. He's trying to get it off his face. That's the type of gentleman that Mike Reed is. The fans, I don't know if you just noticed, Dean, being very vocal in support of their champion, Tank Tolan. They love this guy, and I do too. Tolan, he's somehow finding the way, rising to his feet, back elbow. Back elbow. Is he going to get out? It's weakening. He's out. Come on. Stop. Come on. Stop. Imagine admonishing the fans. This is horrible. I can't even hear myself think. I'm so distracted. There's all this stuff going on. How can I properly do my job if I can't hear myself think? I'm waiting for you to properly do your job anyway. Well, I never hex. Always getting involved, always sticking your nose. Hicks, look, I made a promise to Don Warren, Tank Tolan's good buddy. They came up together, I don't know if you knew that. I didn't. But I made a promise to Don Warren that I would not interject myself in any of these matches. I was hired to commentate, and that's what I'm doing. Fair enough. Tank Tolan back on the outside. Mike Reed, he won't even give him an inch. Mike Reed is a very smart individual. The more pain he puts onto this man, the worse it gets for Tank Tolan. Tank Tolan, of course, has had injuries throughout the years. And he is zeroing in on each one. I can't believe the change in philosophy, the way Mike Reed has downgraded, in my opinion. Downgraded? How dare you, Hicks? I don't like the new philosophy. I think he was more than capable of winning any heavyweight title on his own. What's going on here? Uh, the action spilled out of the ring. Mike Reed. Oh! Security is out in force. Yeah, why is Big E money out there? This, uh, this match is very chaotic. Oh, and Tank is attacking the Burgundy Brigade. Tank Tolan just fighting, just struggling to get back into the ring. Is Mike Reed going to let him in? This is. Oh, oh Tank blocks it. Blocked. Mike Reed, Reed gets a turnbuckle for his efforts. And now we got Tanky scaling. But what is, uh, oh, Mark Angel Dude, getting involved. This needs to stop. His shoelace is still untied, X. That Slim Burgundy disgusts me. What's wrong with this guy? I, I'm not sure what you're talking about. I was distracted by Nathan Avery. Well, there's what a happened? lot of distractions going on when the Burgundy Brigade's out here. What Every happened? match I, is a handicap match. Nathan Avery was uh, jaw jacking with the referee. Mike Reed uh, now. Oh, no. This is a dangerous predicament. Reminiscent of the night that Tank Tolan won the title. They're both scaling. Both at the top here. Oh, this can't be good for either man. This is the kind of move that shortens careers, Dean. Oh, oh! That could have been very scary. Very scary indeed. Both men are down. Mr. Fischl, Anthony Rock, gonna... That's okay, we're fine. Both men down, Anthony Rock starting to count. Oh, what's this? What do we got here? The Gunners are out. Oh, it's about time. Finally, the odds are even. 
But both men are down. Finally, we have even odds. That's fair. Well, I understand, but uh, what's going on with the match itself? Oh, well, right the now, crowd. challenger and champion are down. Tyreno. The Gunners. The Burgundy Security. Brigade going at it all around the ringside. Security is having a very difficult time earlier in the night. Oh, Mark Angel just went into the wall there. On the other side of the ring, Nathan Avery and Ty Reno going at it. Security trying to break this up. It's bedlam. Anthony, Ro oh, and there's a trash can that's just been Good. dumped. Good, Mark Angel deserves to go in the trash. My goodness. Nathan Avery looking worse for wear. Here's my thing, it's good to see the Burgundy Brigade get some back. They're always doing three oh, on Nathan one, Avery trips four on the one. Steps. This is a dangerous predicament. It's about time we have even dots. And inside the ring, champion and challenger, both down. I have to say the gun has maybe brought Tank Toll in some time. Oh my goodness! Some burgundy can't We're control We're crashing into steel. Oh my goodness! We're fighting to the back. But you oh, know what? In the back. I burgundy heard brigade has been neutralized, Tyreno, nobody and that's what's in. important. There goes pure darkness. Burgundy brigade has been oh neutralized. My God. Tank Dolan, uh, to Thank his God! Feet right now. Slim Burgundy finally getting his. Oh, and now they're gonna go at it, and the odds this, have been even. This is the way it should be. Oh, so you're admitting the odds were off kilter. Now, finally, if Mike Reed wins the belt, he deserves it. And if Tank Cohen wins, he Mike deserves it. Lariat. Another, Another one. A drop kick. Wow. Tolan sending him into the ropes right now. Reed kicks to the oh, midsection. No, he He's, He's lowering the knee. knee. Ducks the knee. No. Oh. There you go. And uh, my goodness, Tank kicks up. This stay, is, away, stay away from the power trip. This is why he's the champion, Dean. Oh, the tank turret. The tank turret, and he could have him. One, what are you doing? Why, why, didn't, it, why didn't Master Official Gigante just oh, kill the crown? I wish the Gunners had a 500-pound idiot to get involved and interfere with him. I hate him. You deserve that. Well, Slim Burgundy has been neutralized. But is it too late for Tank Tolan? Oh, oh a low blow! No, no. Mike Reed, he oh. got the knee lift! This could be it, Dean! This could be we it! We can have a new champion! Two, and the, the gold oh. is up to the Burgundy Brigade! Tank Tolan kicked out! No, he didn't. What are you talking about? There's the heart of a champion! These are the moments! That was clearly a three. We talk about the proving grounds. These are the moments where the grounds are proven, Dean. Mike Look Reed can't this. believe it. Mike Reed cannot believe it. The frustration, the fans turning their back on him. It's not over, though. We could have another knee lift right now. He's sizing him up, Dean. We could have an upgrade, too. Who knows? Oh, he's going for his finisher, the upgrade. Oh! Oh! Tank reversal! Catches a super kick! Oh! Oh! oh the power trip! He hit him with the power trip! This is it! Two! Three! He got him! Yes! Yes! Like this. It's moments like this. If I could encapsulate a moment, this is it. Will you stop encapsulating moments? Tank Tolan is still your champion. The look on his face, though, Dean. The winner of the match, and still your world heavyweight champion, Tank Tolan. He may be the champion, Dean. He may very well be the champion, but he might not be a winner, Dean. Because these are the kind of matches that shorten careers. Slim Burgundy. Mike Reed being carried out.
up by the moon. What is this? What is this? What is this? And as I scratch and claw through the brush, and I stare through the eyes of a psycho, I see a mountain. I stare at the mountain, and I look to the top of the mountain, and I see a man standing there.